Hi all and we're welcome to the Climber Report live from Click Connections here in Dallas. Today I'm very pleased to have Mike Capone, the CEO of Click, and he's joining us for a pre-connections heads up. And he will be interviewed by Jan Sipek, the CEO of Climber. Please enjoy. Hi Mike. Hi Jan, how are you? Fine, thanks. Good to be here in Dallas. It's great. It's great to have you here again. Thanks. So how many people have you gathered this time? So we're going to be over 3,000 this year, which is phenomenal. It's about an 18% growth in the number of customers attending. Wow, that's great. Okay, so, uh, so I'm going to ask you a few questions. So first, uh, I'm, I'm Gartner and other analysts that are seeing a lot of trends in the BI market, like uh, AI, of course, mm -hmm. and then natural language, chatbots everywhere. So, I mean, from your perspective as a CEO of a BI company, what do you see? Key trends. Yeah, there are really three big trends that we're tracking right now. One is sort of the obvious move to cloud. So even though uh, not all companies have made the move, there is a bit of inevitability to move into the cloud. And so what you're going to see from us at this conference is some big announcements on how we're helping customers transition to the cloud at their pace. And it's okay. not a force thing, it's at their pace. Second thing you mentioned is big data. So um, our view at Click is all data is big data. Big data is just data. So we're orienting our platform to work with any size data that you want. You don't need special tools to actually handle big data. And again, you'll see some demonstrations of okay. that. And then the last thing you mentioned was uh, machine learning and AI, uh, which our view is that um, machine learning and AI make analytics more human, not less. So our philosophy is we augment human capabilities and analytics. And some of the things you'll see around our Insight Bot, the crunch acquisition that I know you yeah. are well aware of, we're going to demonstrate how things like natural language processing and machine learning and AI can actually make analytics more human and raise the data literacy of our end users. So, so this is how this plays into your uh, product roadmap and, and the acquisitions you you have Crunchbot and you have Attunity too. So what else that to is that the cloud? Yeah, we've been uh, we've been busy. So over the last year, we've done uh, close to six hundred million dollars in acquisition. So I think last year people were asking me how serious is Click about competing and winning. Uh, we're deadly serious, and I got six hundred million dollars behind yeah, that, that, shows, that statement shows, to prove it. Okay. Um, so in addition to our organic R and D, uh, we've done a few strategic acquisitions: Crunch, which is the Insight Bot, which we talked about. Uh, natural language processing. The two other ones, Attunity. Uh, Attunity is a, uh, a data platform that enables uh, data to be transferred from operational systems where data is typically locked up into analytics platforms real time. Okay. So a big question for Click has always been, can you enable okay, real time so analytics? Like real -time. Yeah. Very excited, Attunity gives us that capability. And that closed just last week, so there's a bunch of people here from Attunity, we're going to tell okay. the story. And then the other acquisition was Podium, which has since become Click Data Catalyst. So a very uh, beautiful consumerized tool to catalog data and let users essentially shop for data. So opportunity to move the data, Podium to, or Click Data Catalyst now to actually catalog the data, and then the beautiful Click Analytics platform to actually make sense of the data, layering in AI and machine learning with our Insight Bot uh, to be able to provide the outcome that our users are looking for. Sounds like a super fun. I'm very excited, as you can tell, Jan. Thank you very much, Mike. We really appreciate you taking the time. For more updates here from Connections, please subscribe to The Climb Report on YouTube. We will be back tomorrow with a summary of the announcements so far. And there is also an interview with Jordan Morrow, the head of data literacy, coming up. So stay tuned.